Hey, what up, Scott? And I'm Charlotte. And tis fall, and fall to me is all kinds of, obviously, we've got the pumpkin spice, you know, all these yes. great events going on. But also, it's really quintessential baking season, right? So we're doing something really, really cool. I see some uh, some pre-baked cinnamon rolls. I see a beautiful dough. What are we making here, Chef? We are making the perfect cinnamon roll schmear. Schmear. The stuff inside the, the roll. the stuff inside, which is the most important. That's true. Because you have to have a nice, even distribution. That's right. There's oh, never enough for it's me. It's just dough. It's just dough. We are actually using a great dough recipe, a milk dough recipe that you can find on hb.com. True. But let's get to the schmear. So okay. we have whip together our egg, our butter, our cinnamon, and our brown sugar, and a little bit of salt. And we like to add salt to all of our sweets because it does a nice balance and sort Pulls of brings out, out some flavors. flavors. Right. Here it is, right here. So and while, you're, while you're smearing on the cinnamon rolls, yes. so you let this dough, we let it proof in cold, so we kind of yes. cold cured it to give a little more flavor to it. It's important to go all the way to the edge with the schmear on one side because Everybody knows the best part of the cinnamon roll is the center. That's right. Go like so, and then we are going to roll the dough up. So you roll them up. So this yes. is a, this can be complicated, but it doesn't have to be. Nope. You just roll it up. It does not have to be perfect. You can see our nope. rolls here. All right, what do we serve with our cinnamon rolls? Well, if you like a breakfast beer, New Belgian 1554 Black Ale or something sweet and bubbly, Fratelli, Macchetto, Pink Moscato. For this and all the recipes, log on to ksat.com slash H-E-B.